Hey, in this video, I'm gonna share my workflow of finding new emails. I'm using a mixture of clay to build my list of accounts and prospects. Then I'm using a new tool that I've started using called Full Enrich to be able to find those emails from clay. I rinsed out all my credits in clay uh, and it's for a few more days until they renew. So first of all, I've got my clay table, which I've recorded a video about using clay to build account lists. I'll link that in the description. Um, then what I want to do is export all of my uh, links leads into a spreadsheet here. And what I've got is the original spreadsheet with all of the results. Then I've got to enrich. This is the spreadsheet that I want to use to enrich. I've just got 50 here just for the, a sample. So I'm gonna file, I'm gonna save as, or download as CSV. That's there in my downloads. Then I'm going to uh, find emails. So let me just go back. This is full enrich. It's a, it allows you to find emails and also phone numbers. I'm just using it for emails at the moment and one email equals one credit. The great thing about full enrich though is they only charge you for credits where they find the email address, so on success. So I'm doing it find email uh, from a CSV file, clicking on that. Then I'm going to upload my CSV. And I'm just gonna quickly map the headers here. So first name, last name, but no, this is actually full name. So, oh, let me just do that again. I think I've spelled it wrong actually. It says first name, but should be full name. So let's go back to there. So that's fine. So full name is here. Company domain, that gives 15% more results. So I've managed to get the company domain very easily from Clay. I've got the company name and also the LinkedIn profile URL. So look, I'm pretty much ready to go. I'm gonna hit continue. And I need to edit contacts and correct any valid uh, values. So it gives me a chance to preview what they're going to be using to find the emails. So nothing is wrong here, everything's valid. So I'm gonna hit continue. Enrich these emails. Boom. And now that's working in the background. Now it's gonna take a few minutes. Uh, I typically find it takes anywhere between like five and 10 minutes, but that's okay. I can move on to a different task now um, whilst that's happening. So it says it's gonna take 10 to 35 minutes. And just to show you the billing, so I think this is one of the really, the most cost-effective ways of finding emails, especially if you're building your list from Sales Navigator on LinkedIn or using other databases uh, like Apollo. Apollo, of course, you can find emails, but they're not all, they're only really from one source. Whereas this use a waterfall enrichment, which is kind of like a new term in prospecting at the moment, but waterfall enrichment means that it looks for multiple sources of the email to confirm whether that email is correct. So you can see here, it uses Apollo Clearbit, uh, Contact Out, Snov, Casper, and 15 other uh, sources as well. So it's a great way to uh, really find more emails from your list. So let's just check on that response. So here we go, it's still, still looking. I'm gonna pause the video for now and then show you the result they have uh, found the emails. It took about 20 minutes, but I was able to work on some of the copy for the campaign and some other tasks as well. This is what you see when the uh, campaign, when the enrichment is complete. We can see that out of the 50 contacts I had, only 35 they were able to find emails for. Uh, the reason that only 33 credits were used is because I've previously found the emails in another list. So that means around 70% of emails are here. So my next step is to download the CSV, but I only want to download the valid emails. I, I don't want to send any emails to catch all or unknown emails or invalid. So I need to click on download the valid emails, which I did already, imported that into the spreadsheet. Uh, and now I can see I've just hidden the emails for um, privacy, uh, but I've got the emails of the 30 or 29 uh, contacts here. Uh, now I'm ready to add them into the sequence or whatever I may be doing next as well. Now important to note that just because you can't find an email for a prospect doesn't mean that they're not a good prospect. So of those uh, the remaining people that I couldn't find their email, I'll most likely run just a LinkedIn only campaign to them as well. Uh, or I could go and look for a way to verify the catch all emails, which I might share in another video in the future. Uh, but yeah, that's it. Full Enrich is an amazing tool. I've started using it and uh, I think it could be very helpful for you to find emails in bulk. Cheers.